You've suffered a stroke. The stroke has affected your ability to speak and to move one side of your body. You're not able to return to work and the doctors won't or can't give you any answers. So you apply for Social Security Disability, but you find out that your claim has been deferred for 90 days. What's going on? As a policy, the Social Security Administration defers all applications that involve stroke for at least 90 days after the date of the incident. This is because the prognosis for a stroke survivor can change dramatically during that period. A stroke occurs when there's an interruption in the flow of blood to the brain and the lack of oxygen causes an injury to the brain. This damage to the brain cells can leave the stroke survivor with both physical and cognitive problems. At first, the damage may be severe. The stroke survivor may be unable to communicate, or one side of the body may be completely paralyzed. However, over time, skills start to come back. The greatest improvement usually occurs in the first month after the stroke. Rehabilitation can also help undo some of the stroke damage. Sometimes the changes are subtle and can only be determined by such special tests as a neuropsychological evaluation. These tests are very helpful in documenting your limitations. The Social Security Administration believes that it's impossible to know the long-term outcome for a stroke survivor in the first 90 days after a stroke. However, this doesn't mean that you should wait three months to apply for Social Security Disability. It takes time to go through the application process. Getting your application in early means you will get your benefits sooner. It's important to tell your doctor about your limitations and how they affect your ability to work. The Social Security disability process is complex and confusing. Give us a call for a free evaluation of your situation. At Cutting in Law, you have a dedicated team of professionals in your corner who understand the system and who will fight for your rights.